The people of Gordo, Alabama eat, drink, sleep football, and rightly so. The Green Wave currently hold the longest streak of consecutive winning seasons in the state of Alabama with an astounding 24. The last time Gordo went below 500 was the year I was born. Our last stop on Alabama Week on the high school football tour is the Gordo Green Wave. WCBI's 60 Schools in 60 Days is brought to you by Toyota, Let's Go Places, and Emerson Animal Hospital, where your pets are family in West Point. It's football time again in the city of Gordo. Last season, the Greenway finished 13-1 and, and fell one game short of a state title appearance. 14 starters returned for the Green Wave, and the team says they're ready to get the season started. Football is a great sport, and we right here football is king, so everybody around the community is talking about it coming up, and we're just down here working hard trying to give us the best opportunity to win when the season gets here. I'm pretty pumped up and excited. You know, I think we got a great team, you know, great chemistry. You know. Just ready. We fell a little short what we wanted to do last year, so it's just another chance to get back, give it another go. When I took the head job, our senior class here, were, they were eighth graders, and uh, to start getting in the weight room with them back in the eighth grade seems like yesterday, and to see them where they're at now, and to see those guys coming out here and talking to you today is a, it's a pretty neat feeling because they've so far have uh, you know, had a great career. Gordo is a mainstay in the Alabama playoffs, reaching the postseason for the 18th straight season in 2016. But after missing out on a state title game for a third straight year, the Green Wave continue to keep their eyes on the prize. Our focus and mindset has not changed. It's what it always is, and that's to work as hard as we can to be the very best that we can be. We know that you know, if we work hard and do the little things the right way, we're going to, you know, we're going to be able to do a lot of great things. It's just, just come ready to work every day. It's no, it's not a revenge thing. It's not nothing. It's just see how good we can be, and we're, we're going to play ourselves pretty much through the whole season. Motto is just finish. And that's the past few years. We've been getting there and getting there and getting closer and closer, and we just haven't been able to pull it out. So we're just going this year and talking about finishing and working hard. It's been 16 years since the Gordo Green Wave were named state champions. This year's squad is looking to put an end to the drought and bring home a gold ball for the Gordo community in 2017. Anytime you get that opportunity, I think it's you know special. We've had three region championships in a row, three county championships in a row, and three West Alabama Conference championships in a row. These guys know what that's about. This community needs it more than anything. You know, We just recently got one in baseball, but I think football, that'd be really Really big for us. Gordo will open their season on the road at Fayette County August 25th. On the tour with the Green Wave, I'm Jonathan Flippo with WCBI Sports. 60 schools in 60 days with Gordo High School was brought to you by the Bank of Vernon, Shop and Save, Vernon Dental, and Alpha Agent Alicia Clark.